endless migration. Vote 5 for an extra congregate point. It's currently 10.07 p.m. Wait a minute, I moved with the... Oh, wait. Forty-five just by done upgrades. But how random that all of the airplanes are? You think that they were? You think that the airplanes would be trying to kill? Especially with how big they can be. Probably only one or two deaths. Believe me, that's somewhat impressive. I can't wait to get some actual upgrades. Lasted entirely. With this many ships. I guess they just got a five point congregate advantage. Much better. Only a really bad storm can hurt us significantly. With a golden geese boost that much. Okay, we're good. We are good at this. Well, I am. So I'm the only one playing it. But when I say we, I refer to both myself and my beast.
okay. Gold eggs and ham. Yep, an impressive 25 up. Star Quarter. I just got another golden goose phone. It's right off the net, Matt. I'm trying to get all the geese I can. Believe me, it's a lot less stressful to them than to you. What? These two hard in these two really hard achievements. We might as well take out the everything else. Okay. Just making sure. Make sure you take out any of the random achievements. A very powerful upgrade indeed. It's not easy protecting a group of 16 keys for 15 seconds. Believe me. You'll spend quite a bit of time trying to do that. You'll have to just keep hoping that no one gets in their way. That they'll just... You have to keep hoping that they just drive away and stay out of harm's way of your geese. Continuing to try is probably not worth it, considering the fact that, well, can result in dire consequences. Every 10,000 points is worth enough trade points. That's the skill. Let's see how long we can 
we go, we're able to go this time. You sometimes don't even know how you managed to get certain certain achievements. You just know that you managed to do it. Um. Ah. Oh. But I managed to do that. Three whole minutes. Let me tell you, it's not very easy to, to get just swamped. Fuck Master Flash. You're gonna start trying to... Yes, I did it. What? I'm aiming for a 15 point congregate badge. Your original floor three will lie for at least a minute. Well, I'm already a sixth of the way there, so don't, we're not going to say that we're guaranteed to do it, although we're currently over water. about the whole thing is
if there's any one achievement that I'm unable to get, I won't be able to get that 50 point to ingredient man. Apparently, it only makes the leader invincible. I don't miss opportunities to earn certain achievements, you know. By this time, you think that Green would have done something about all this time. But they ultimately don't. And that's pretty incredible. There, now we're speedy enough to potentially actually manage to avoid all the air Each failed attempt makes each failed attempt makes it even harder to try again. If you the first time you fail the achievement in a game, you essentially won't get the entire game. Essentially. It might still happen, but we've got a little bit more chance. You'll probably get that achievement last. They'll get fine. They won't be able to clean off the blood. At least not quickly. It'll probably take them at least 10 minutes to clean off all the blood. Maybe even more than an hour. Boy, oh boy, are we staying off. We got 22 out of 29 achievements, which makes it somewhat impressive. Now the only uh, only upgrade left is that. We have to start the attempt as soon as possible. Okay, good.
There is a wide variety of air vehicles designed to make it impossible to protect all 16 of full flight for any amount of time than 10 seconds. That one achievement is going to be hard to earn for a long time. Indeed, that last 400 toy upgrade isn't going to make it that easier, but it will make those two time upgrades easier. Far enough into the game, you won't even be able to get up to 16. You've got to do it as early as possible. After that, you start attempting, you start attempting silly achievements. Now, not only for, we have to go 30 seconds dodging not only all of our, every single geese, but all the airships too. And let me tell you, it's not hard trying, it's pretty hard to try to dodge all the geese. Trust me, some of the achievements are going to be real tough to earn. Attempt the no flock for 30 seconds up here again. Do you have an, uh, any idea how long 15 seconds is? A quarter of a minute. 25% of the entire minute. Have you ever had to wait a minute? I'm sure you've had to several times. Shorten that time by 75% and that's exactly how long it is. Not a long length of time, but still, when there's this many air vehicles flying at you, it's about as easy as, well, trying to get into you. And becoming, trying to become President of the United States because there's a legendary a 1 in 10 million chance of one doing it. You know, it's not a good idea to give an exact probability of it because as long as you try hard enough, you should be able to do it. You 
start getting point, points at a slower rate because all the airplanes quickly kill off your geeks. A total of 25 times. I just hope that no geese come here on this way. Took out one of the hard achievements. Especially if you got all those upgrades increasing the speeds. Some games you'll only get one achievement. And in a lot of them, you'll you won't even get one. The end was my brain food, to be honest. Let me tell you, it doesn't feel it. It's not really endless, because I'm sure there are actual migrations that last for months, maybe even years. But here it only at, but here it doesn't even last minutes. What were they thinking? May made it endless migration. Sure, if you combine all your total attempts, then yeah, it is sort of like that. That was pretty lucky, managing to dodge that jumbo jet, but it still didn't get me that achievement. You can see how tough it is to get. Believe me, I'll get it sooner or later. Or at least I should. Hopefully. But this one's going to be my distance player. No achievement for getting all the upgrades, so don't worry, you don't have to do that. And now I should be able to get those achievements for survival. Stealth attack. Apparently, one of those airships went camo. After the 42nd mark, it pretty much becomes impossible. And if your attempt goes past the 42nd mark, you're asking for some serious luck. If you make an attempt after the 42nd mark, you're asking for some real serious luck. Because really, there's so many air vehicles by then that you that you're more like probably more likely to win the lottery. There's no scientific study on that, but it's basically a good example of showing you how lucky you are to 
successfully pull it off. I'm talking about Matthew protecting our full block of geese in this game for 15 seconds after the 42nd one. Not the easiest thing in the world to do exactly. Uh oh, we already lost our first life. It does it three times, so we still have two more safeties. Wow, that was pretty lucky. Managing to get a golden geese bonus for even a slight amount of time. Now all that's left is the very hardest achievements that you just can't manage to get. A million points in a single game. Just 16 swans. I don't know what they were thinking getting giving the achievement for the badge for getting all fifth all 29 achievements a medium. Just a medium? Well, it's currently 10.40 p.m. till next time.